hello there how are you i hope all is well and everything is absolutely amazing on your end welcome back on my channel you're listening to light channelings once again and i'm back with a new reading for all of you before starting with the reading allow me to express my gratitude for the beautiful loving positive energy you're sending towards me may god bless you with abundance in all of its beautiful forms and without wasting any of our time let's begin with the reading in today's reading i'm seeing two different situations two different cases where one group of people experienced cheating infidelity and betrayal in their soul connection coming from their soul counterpart while other group of people may have experienced or got affected by black magic witchcraft spell work done on to them by someone else in order to create separation in their soul connection or cause heavy negativity which ultimately led to separation in their soul connection okay this doesn't mean that you can't relate with the other group of people if you fall into one as i see that for many of you both the situations apply in some of your lives in some of your personal cases so if that's what happened and you resonate with this past occurrence or something that is going on at present in your life or in regards to your soul connection then this reading is definitely meant for you or we can say that you are being presented with guidance and clarity on your present situation and what you can expect to come and happen in the coming future okay so to start with the reading first of all i'm going to tell you something which happened in some of your distant past for others this could be happening right now at present okay so in whichever group you fall what's coming is same what's happening is also similar and the overall outcome is also going to be same for both the group of people or for everyone who experienced and encountered these kind of situations circumstances obstacles challenges or difficulties in regards to their soul connection okay so let's talk about the first group of people who experienced or are experiencing the ill effects of some sort of black magic witchcraft and spell work being done onto them or onto their soul counterpart or in general onto their soul connection to cause negativity hostility and conflict within the counterparts you may have experienced that because of this your counterparts attitude and behavior completely changed towards you this happened because someone did something either onto you onto them or with your soul connection it's because of this your counterpart may have done something or said something extremely terrible with you they may have betrayed you they may have lied to you they may have done something extremely deceptive and mischievous behind your back i also see that they started mistreating you disrespecting you taking you for granted and humiliating or insulting you for no absolute reason their behavior towards you changed completely and uncertainly you couldn't figure it out as to how and why it's all happening their uh, behavior and their actions towards you became extremely unpredictable and this gave you a lot of anxiety sorrow pain sadness and suffering okay this really broke your heart this may have caused you to 
go into depression or this may have also led to separation or divorce for some of you is what I see may have happened here okay as I said there are people who experienced both the cases where it's because of black magic they experienced infidelity and cheating in their soul connection that's why I'm saying and bringing this point again and again so that people can know why things happened the way they did that does not mean your counterpart did not have any role to play or they were completely innocent no these attacks and these spells need negative energy to feed off from so if there was no fault in their mindset attitude mentality or with their character this may have never happened or succeeded okay so you have to understand these things as well I'm not saying that you go back to them and you know start laying on the ground for them to walk over you all over again I'm not suggesting anything as such to anyone so be careful and be mindful as well with how you interpret the messages and how discerning you are when you listen to channel guidance and you try to implement and apply that guidance in your personal life i'm not saying that your counterpart should be completely forgiven and you should go back and embrace them with all of your heart we'll talk about that later right now i'm trying to say and i'm trying to bring you as much clarity as much i can so that you can release that hurt that pain and that confusion you are in at present because i see that you also got affected by this negative energy a lot this sudden change in the attitude of your counterpart and their behavior really affected you negatively you couldn't understand why it's all happening how all of a sudden they turned so bitter and rude towards you how their uh, love turned into complete disdain and despise you couldn't figure that out this was the reason i feel like not just your soul counterpart but you were also getting affected by the ill effects of the spell or black magic being done onto you or on your soul connection someone did it and it looks like it was a woman that doesn't necessarily mean that for each and every one of you it was a woman it could be someone who likes to control it could be someone who is a professional with all of these things i mean this person professionally does black magic and is quite proficient in doing all these things this could be someone who hired a professional to do this on to you or on your soul connection okay whoever this person was or is is in a very terrible and horrible situation right now the person who did black magic on to you as well as the person who caused your counterpart to cheat on you betray you and the person who brought infidelity in your soul connection is in a very horrible and terrible situation right now or is about to land into one in the near future that's the first thing okay i'm also seeing that even your soul counterpart is going to experience something similar something way more horrible and terrible in their life because of getting involved with this person or we can say after getting involved with this person because if they cheated on you if they betrayed you if they brought another person which led to a heartbreaking ending in your soul connection 
they ended up creating heavy negative karma for themselves and what's coming is something they won't be able to handle properly okay this person they chose over you is horrifyingly toxic and negative this person is going to destroy them is what i see is either happening right now or is about to happen in the coming future that to in the near future not way too distant one but in the near future this might actually be happening right now in some of your cases okay whoever was involved or was the cause behind all of this including your soul counterpart they all are in very terrible and horrible situations right now something may have already happened here or is about to happen which is very very tormenting distressing and quite negative in nature okay if i talk about the person who did black magic on to you something extremely terrible is about to happen with this person well what i see here happening is related to some sort of sickness illness or even death for others it's something which is even worse than uh, dying which means something so horrible and so terrible no one can expect or imagine least think about or wish for that's what actually happens with these people who mess with other people's lives using black magic and witchcraft the reason behind all of this is karma clearing you had karma to clear with these souls or these people that's what actually happened or is going on at present that does not mean you should let go or break down all your boundaries you have created with your soul counterpart or others involved i'm not suggesting anything like that this is being said so that you can have clarity about your past your present as well as your coming future okay so that you can let go of that pain that sorrow and that suffering which is disturbing you which is becoming the cause of your ill health or uh, your unhappiness once we are clear about the causes behind our suffering and the reasons why things happened the way they did we can let go of everything that doesn't serve us okay if this was another person who came in between in order to destroy your connection and get settled with your soul counterpart in a relationship or commitment i see that this person is also going through something similar with that of this black magic practitioner they are in similar situations and circumstances something extremely negative and horrible is about to happen with these people for what they've done in your life or have created in your life this is only brought to your knowledge and attention to understand and learn how karma works and what happens with the people who choose the path of darkness over the path of light this has nothing to do with extracting pleasure or enjoying over people suffering and over them receiving their karma no i do not suggest anyone to have a attitude like that i do not suggest anyone to take pleasure or happiness out of anyone's pain even if the other person is your enemy or a perceived enemy let's say and this person may have brought you a lot of pain sorrow and suffering may have done you wrong beyond limits i still suggest guide and advise people to remain as positive as peaceful and as calm as possible and not allow any kind of negativity ego arrogance or pride get in the way of their spiritual growth 
and personal development these people who came into your life these people who kind of brought upheaval in your life or this heartbreaking ending in your soul connection or just this separation this happened because of the karma you created with these souls in your past lives and it needed to get cleared away okay what they did with you is something they are paying for right now or are going to pay for in the coming future if you did not do anything wrong to these people if you were completely innocent and truthful you have nothing to worry about as your future looks bright and prosperous i see here that sooner than later both of you i mean you and your soul counterpart are going to come out of this negative situation this troublesome situation and both of you are going to be able to move towards desired circumstances outcomes happiness joy and abundance i see that both of you are going to find a way out of your present situations circumstances and challenges if your counterpart was in a karmic connection which was built on negativity toxicity or which was created by the use of black magic and witchcraft i see ultimate ending taking place in that connection which is not going to be positive and pleasing at all for all the parties involved it's going to be a very painful and devastating ending as a result of people getting exposed and everyone's true colors coming out into the light for everyone to see something which is hidden since a very long period of time is going to come out into the light they are going to realize who this person is and how negative this person is how hostile this person is how envious jealous and full of viciousness this person is the person your soul counterpart was dealing with and that would be the ultimate end point of their connection they may have to practice or uh, show a lot of strength courage and confidence in order to find a way just to simply walk out and away from that connection or that person i see that they are still going to do it no matter how difficult it might seem in the beginning no matter how much that other person may try to bring them down no matter how many attacks this trickster this manipulator or the sorcerer may send onto you onto them i mean your soul counterpart or how many efforts this person may make to bind your connection both of you are going to find a way out of these attacks this negativity and these traps i'm seeing that these karmic cycles are going to come to an end and both of you are going to find a way out you are going to realize that or i can say your counterpart is going to realize that something was off something was just not right and they're going to walk away if there is other person they're going to walk away from that person if it's just about black magic then also the karma you have with this soul is going to get cleared away and then even if this person tries to attack you after that or continues to make an effort to bind you or your soul connection it's not going to work it might affect you till you have that last bit of karma to clear with this person or the soul but after that no matter how much this person attacks you it's not going to work once the karma is cleared once the lessons are learned once the cycles are over 
you'll be able to move on and move forward in your life towards healing joy abundance happy family reunion and reconciliation i'm seeing here that if you guys were already married you are going to reunite and start a new life once again together if you were not married i see that you can get married or are going to choose to get married or start a new family together after reuniting with your soul counterpart i am seeing this possibility here and this is going to happen because your love is true this is going to happen because your connection is pure and is based on true love this is going to happen because you'll clear your karma and there's going to be no other blockage left which is going to hinder you or stop you from experiencing bliss happiness joy and abundance which is meant for you which is written in your fate by the grace of god okay of course it's going to take a lot of forgiveness from your end if there was cheating or infidelity acceptance is needed ability to look at things from a higher perspective is also needed so if this can happen then i see that you'll be able to move forward in your life if you cannot forget if you cannot forgive let's say if you can forgive but not forget i still see you moving on and moving forward in your life towards a better situation situation circumstance or a beautiful outcome taking place in your life that's what i see is going to happen okay what i'm trying to say here is that you won't end up hating on to each other forever you won't end up having a unhappy ending in your soul connection the ending is going to be beautiful happy and positive no matter what you do or what choices and decisions you make in regards to your soul connection i see that things are going to end on a positive note in your soul connection with your soul connection if we say it in other words okay i see that your counterpart is going to start making moves towards you or are just going to start realizing your worth and value your counterpart is going to move towards love towards their uh, true wishes towards their soul connection towards their soul counterpart which is going to ultimately lead them back towards you and then there is going to be healing happiness joy abundance which can lead to a happy healthy harmonious family life as well if you choose to do so okay i feel like if this happens maybe at first you are going to experience a lot of distress in being able to forgive forget or show some understanding i feel like you are going to be guarded and quite fearful of your counterpart's intentions or past repeating itself once again but with time you'll find healing you'll recover from that trauma those fearful thoughts emotions or the after effects of trauma or this traumatic experience you had to go through so overall it all looks beautiful and positive you have nothing to worry about anything that is going on right now okay whoever this person is who did this to you whether it be a manipulator or a sorcerer or another third party who came in between and caused your counterpart to cheat on you their end looks very horrible and devastating i wouldn't wish such karma on to anyone no would i even suggest anyone to feel happy about their karma just remain neutral and understand how karma works learn from this situation and learn from these people's mistakes if you can if you are willing to and let go don't feel happy don't become joyful don't celebrate onto other people's downfall or 
torment because we are not like that okay so that's all i see that you are attracting wonderful outcomes i see that something extremely beautiful and positive is going to happen in your life in the coming future i see that by god's grace you and your soul counterpart are going to come closer and are also going to come back together more harmoniously more peacefully more lovingly and more joyfully there is going to be harmony there is going to be peace you may travel together you may move in together if you choose to obviously okay so that's all this was your reading i hope you enjoyed listening to me and this brought you the clarity you were seeking and were hoping to get if so do let me know how you felt in the comment section below feel free to hit the like button and do subscribe this channel for more such content to be readily available for all of you on a regular basis with that being said do not hesitate to follow through with the link given in the description box below if your heart says so that's all i'll be back sooner than later till then take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye